Hey guys sorry I haven't been uploading. As you can see I haven't uploaded in almost 3 months. Well if you're wondering why I haven't been uploading it's a personal reason. So I won't go into too much detail. I did also make a video on why I haven't been uploading. I did remove it because it was created into a short lol. But yeah, I will be uploading more soon. Wait, but before we start make sure to subscribe or else this will be watching you every day. But if you're subscribed then here's a cookie. Also quick disclaimer, I will use the names of what the game calls them because I simply don't know what they're called. But, anyways this car is rare. I don't know why it's rare even though it has good stats and everything. Yet, despite having good stats it's really rare to see in game. The most likely theory is that the other hyper cars that are cheaper than this look better. All those pictures I showed you are the cars that are in the game. And more specifically these are options more people prefer to go to because they're popular. Which makes this car rare because it's like nobody notices it. Next we have this Lamborghini on the list. As you all know this was part of the Easter update. Basically, you had to collect a certain amount of eggs to get this car. This car will never come back and now the further we go into 2021 this car has become more and more rare. This car was really common when it was available I haven't seen anybody using it since. It looks pretty cool and most of you can agree on that. And no I'm not talking about the Lamborghini Huracan a lot of you will get confused with both cars. If this car ever comes back it will most likely be an Easter which is like 8 or 10 months it's say. we have a hypercar. This car came out like 2 through 4 months ago. When it came out it costed 12,500,000 and was a limited. Which means if you look at the shop right now it will not be there because it's off sale. This car is limited, I'm not sure when the creator will add this car back. But all I can say he is probably gonna put it for sale back eventually. This car is rare because of its price and because it was a limited time before it was gonna go away. The price was super expensive which meant a lot of people couldn't afford it. Lots of people were probably planning on getting it but their car wasn't good enough for money. Others probably spent their money more useful. And most importantly people didn't buy it because its stats were not that good for its price. It has a top speed of 256 miles per hour. And if you go to shop you can find cars that cost less and are faster. Which explains why it's so rare. Next we have a Pagani. This car is also limited like the last one. It costed 10 million dollars. It has terrible stats for being that expensive. And it looks kind of bad, but we're gonna let my bias opinion slide and actually figure out why it's rare. So obviously we can say it's rare because it's limited and people would not buy a 10 million dollar car that isn't that good. 
you can buy cars and 100 times better that are cheaper. For example, the $8 million car goes 282 miles an hour, and the Pagani goes 218 miles per hour. It was last seen over two months. Next we have another hypercar. This price will shock quite a bit of you, it costs 25 million dollars. It was last seen around 3 through 4 months ago. I'd say only like 1000 through 3000 people actually obtained this car. I'm not sure when it's coming back. Right now it's the second fastest car in the game. And goes 300 miles per hour. It's also limited which means if you go to shop it won't be there. This is one of my favorite cars and it also looks like a Divo that's $7,500,000 in the game. This is another Bugatti and it's also another Limited. This car is the first ever Limited to come out. There was a lot of hype in this update. It costed $18,700,000 and went 265 miles per hour. It was last seen over 7 months ago. When the update came out only like 5 or 10,000 people were playing. Now obviously that's extremely expensive. When this update came out it was absolutely worth it because it was the second fastest car and the fastest car you can obtain without Robux. If it were to come out now it would be like 5th fastest and I wouldn't consider buying it. But like I said it would not come out again for a very long time so I would get it. Next we have an old Ferrari. In real life this car cost like 50 million dollars I think. But in the game it cost 10 million dollars thankfully. In real life you can buy a house. Or buy thousands of supercars with 50 million dollars. This car was last seen over 3 months. This car is probably rare because it has the worst stats it goes 175 miles per hour I think. For 175 miles per hour for 10 million dollars, no thanks, honey. Next, we have another car. This car costs 10 million dollars, and our game is limited. For some reason, the creator of the game is obviously obsessed with the number 10 million. But yeah, this was last seen six months ago. It was part of the New Year's update. And in my opinion it looks amazing and the thing that ruins this car is its stats. It goes 224 miles per hour. Still it has pretty good acceleration if you ask me. Next we have another Ferrari. This was part of the Christmas update where you had to collect a certain amount of presents to obtain this car. Basically it was the same as the Easter event just a replacement with presents. I haven't seen this car in ages. I only seen it when the update just dropped. I'd say I haven't seen the car in 6 months. This car is incredibly rare I cannot even explain it. It was part of the Frozen Lake update and was last seen 3 through 5 months. It costed 10 million dollars. Honestly this list was incredibly hard to make it took me half an hour. I literally couldn't decide if the Ferrari I just showed should be the most rarest car on the list. I would say they are the same rarity. Just this one is a little more rare because less people own it.